Yeah, <laughs> going with different approaches and stuff. I think I also used to get a little frustrated because, like I said, I never really fully committed to one thing. So I'd get really into drawing, then maybe I'd mm. get into something else, then I'd get into mm. something else, and I usually wouldn't mix it very much. Mm. So then I'd come back to drawing and get a little frustrated because I think if I just kept drawing, I would have been better by now. Mm -hmm. Like, got I think a little. There was a time like that too because I was really into playing games like four years. And I was like, man, if I. If I only spent that same time mm. <laughs> drawing, maybe I would have been better. But then, you know, it's it's no use regretting. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes, thinking about it, because if I did not draw in those years, I wouldn't have drawn that much anyway. Mm. But I enjoyed that time on something else, like something else that interests me at the time. Even though it might not be related to drawing itself, you might have learned something new that you might not have learned if you kept drawing only. So... What a... What a good like, outlook! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like... Well, what's what's past is past. There's no point only like, you know, beating yourself up with stuff that's past, right? Mm. But you still have time from now and onwards. If you feel like devoting yourself to drawing again, then why not? If you feel like doing something else as yeah. a hobby, why not? Just don't... I guess, be like, oh, I could have been better if I tried harder. Be like, oh, yeah, I did not try harder then. Let's do a little better now. Mindset. Not only mm. are you an onigiri, but you are a mountain. <laughs> Wise Ina of the mountain. 